Hello everyone, in today's video I'm going to show you how to make these beautiful satin fabric flower and if you're curious to see how that's done, then keep on watching. In this video, you're going to need some glue and one inch satin ribbon, a candle or a lighter, whichever one you prefer, and an alligator clip, a crafting tweezer, a needle and some thread to match the color of your flower, felt fabric to match the color of your flower, or you could also use white, fabric cutting scissors. You will also need some rhinestones, so this is a preference of whatever color you want to be the center. This flower has a total of 12 petals, six on top and six on the bottom. We will be cutting out the ribbons for the top levels and for the top level I will be using the one inch ribbon and this will be two and a half inch in length. I usually have a template so that I know what I'm cutting and each of the petals will be the exact same size. Now I'm going to be cutting the ribbon for the bottom layer and this one is going to be 3 inches in length. So I'll be needing 6 pieces. Now you can see here I have 6 petals for the top layer and, six, and another 6 layer for the bottom layer. So what we want to do next is fold the ribbon like this and then we're going to fold it like this. And then take our tweezer and burn off the edges so that they stay in place. This is what the petals for the top layer looks like. Now I'm going to repeat this step for the rest of the top petals. Now that we have our six petal for the top level, I'm going to be doing the exact same step for the bottom petals. I'm going to be cutting a felt circle that is four centimeter in diameter. Here I've created a template for it so that I can try to make a very nice circle, well, as nice of a circle as I can. It doesn't have to be perfect as you can't really see it anyways. You'd want to tie a knot at the end of your thread so that the petals doesn't fall out. I usually like to do two knots to make sure that it is secure. So now we're going to put each of the petals through the thread like this. Here is what the bottom layer looks like. Now we're going to do the same for the top layer. We will be adding some glue to our felt circle. We're going to flip the bottom layer of the flower down and we're going to put the felt circle on top with the glue towards the petal side. Now we're going to add some glue to the bottom of the top layer. We're also going to add some glue to the center. And then add our rhinestone on top. And finally to make this a hair clip, we're going to put some glue on the alligator clip. And now our flowers are completed. 